sorry to hit you in the head. Yeah, it's all right. My name's Jeremy. This is Jared. We're going to go over another way uh, to get into a triangle choke from a scissor sweep position. I believe I was gripping this side before. You can also grip this side. And actually it might be a little better because the jacket can move more when you pull for a scissor sweep. So if I grab this side, there are some chokes that might not be available, but I get more of a pull. And I want to grip up here. And then I'm going to put my feet on the floor, slide away, get my knee on the inside like so. Uh, for this to work, I have to go for the scissor sweep. If he doesn't defend it, I'm going to pull him up, up onto me a little bit, scissor, and that's great. Now I'm holding this arm because I don't want him to post. So either when I go for the scissor sweep, he pulls it out, he just rips out of my grip and post and stops it, or I'm sneaky and I don't hold it very tight because I want him to post. So I come out, and when I go for it, he posts. Now there's a big gap in here. So now I just pull my leg out, and I've got a hold of his collar, so I'm going to reel him in into the triangle. So we're going to be sneaky. I've got a hold of his sleeve. I'm going to, I'm going to do this really hard, and I'm going to, on purpose, let him post. So I go for the right there, pull the leg out, reel him in with the grip that I have, triangle. Bridge up. Notice I haven't let go of this. Try to cross. Then put my foot in his hip, get an angle. Grab the shin, underhook the arm here, or the leg. I can't reach the leg right now, so let's do this, and lock in the triangle. Do it a little quicker. I'm sorry to hit you in the head. Yeah, it's all right. Try to hit you this time. Appreciate it. <laughs>